Hi guys, so uh, we're here inside Canva and here you can see the different types of graphics that we can create, okay? So here in the social media post, we can uh, create different types of graphics such as Twitter posts, Pinterest graphic, okay, for Facebook, Tumblr, and Instagram posts, okay? Sorry, if you're um, into more formal documents, we can uh, create a US letter size document, okay? PowerPoint presentation, A4 size um, document, letterheads, magazine covers, certificates, resume, and yearbook. Okay, so if you're an aspiring author or a blogger, there's also some designs for you, such as book cover. Okay, so this is an actual book cover, not just an ebook. Okay, this is for real hardcover book. Okay. And there's also Wattpad book cover, which um, if you're a writer on Wattpad, which is a um, platform for writers, okay, you can create a Wattpad book cover. Or if you have a blog, then uh, you can design a blog banner, okay, CD cover, infographics, okay, and if you have a business, then there are also marketing materials for you, okay, you can create posters, menus, flyers, logos, brochure, gift certificate, business card, and label, okay? And if you're into social media, there are also um, some graphics for you, such as Facebook event covers, YouTube thumbnails, Tumblr banner, YouTube channel art, Twitter header, Google header, okay? And if you have a shop on Etsy, okay? Then you can also have an Etsy shop cover, okay? So as you can see, there are many, many different types of graphics you can create using Canva. And you can create almost any graphic, okay? I can say almost, okay? Not everything, but most of the graphics you need to design is available on Canva, okay? So if you're into ads, you can also have Facebook ads. And there's also different banner ads available okay here's the white skyscraper ad large rectangle ad and leaderboard ad okay these are all banner ads okay if you're into advertising for google then there's um different banner ads okay so now let's create um social media graphic okay just you can see here at social media post there are different kinds of social media posts such as Twitter, Pinterest, Facebook, etc. But we will create a um, generic social graphic which um, you can use for any type of social media. Okay, So let's click this social graphic. And the dimension for this is 800 pixels by 800 pixels. Okay, So let's just click that. Okay, So this is a um, social graphic. Okay, So here on the left, side you can see the different templates available okay so um let's just choose um template okay you can see here for example um scroll down okay let me just choose okay there are many um beautiful templates available here okay for example this one okay so we can change the text, okay, just click the text and we can just change it. Okay, for example, I'll just change that to this. Okay, and if you want to um, delete some text, just click it and then click this delete icon on the upper right corner. So let's just delete that. Okay, and let's just adjust the size. Okay, so just highlight this. And then click here on the numbers, okay, and then let's make it smaller, okay. So we want to change the background color, okay. So just click this um, background, okay. Actually, this is this um, yellow, this brownish, yellowish design. You can also change that. So um, just click here on the color, pick a color, and we can change that to different colors, okay. So if you don't like any of the available colors here, just click this plus sign here and you will be led to a color picker. 
okay so you can choose the specific color that you want okay for example this and if you have a specific color code then you can just paste it here okay so I'll show you the color code so let's go to Google okay and look for color picker okay so there will be different um, available col results here so let's just click this HTML color picker from W3 schools and you can choose a specific color because here um sorry here the color picker here is a bit hard to use okay because um it's not it's looks a bit mixed up so uh, we can just um choose this color picker for example you like a specific color for example this one then you can see um the code okay the color code is here okay with the asterisk sign and the color code so if you like this color okay for example this color or this color just choose the color code okay just copy the color code okay and then paste it here in the color code section in this box okay just paste it okay all right so this looks similar to the one earlier so let's choose a different color code He'll copy the color code and then paste, um, click the plus sign again and then paste the color code. Okay. So if you want to change the background, um, click here on the left section, click background and then choose the background color that you want. Okay, so there are different background colors. Um, you can also scroll down and you can see that there are different background designs, okay, that is not just a plain color, okay, you can see here, just click here, see, you can um, choose different um, background designs, okay, just scroll down, these are all free, okay, okay, just scroll down, there are many, many different um gradient designs available if you don't like the plain color okay there's um for example this pink one okay all right so you can also upload a custom background okay if you don't want this then there are also um pictures but you can see here on the left section there's uh it says one us dollar okay um, if you choose this um, pictures with that says one US dollar, you need to pay one dollar to use this. Okay, so for example, let's just click this, the flower design that says one US dollar. You can see here there are some um, grids. Okay, if you can see it, um, or just this grids here, these are the watermark. Okay, this is the watermark, and it means that you need to pay one dollar for it okay because if not the watermark will stay in there okay so to remove the watermark you need to pay one dollar okay but um you can choose the free designs because there are many free designs like this so you can see here there is no watermark okay so once you're happy with the design you can just click download and you can choose um jpg png or PDF type of download so for example I'll just choose JPEG okay and then click download okay so it's um, still preparing the design okay okay so you can see that um, the design is um, downloaded here so just I'll just click here and you can see that this is the social media post that we made using Canva. Okay, so there's also different um, designs. So if you want to go back to the templates, just click here on the section that says layouts. Okay, on the left side, it says layouts, and you will go back to the different um, layouts. Okay, for example, here then choose the design you want and then click replace okay so that is how you um
create a social media post using Canva.